Good morning. It is August 19th, 2015. Time is 0611 a.m. Eastern Time here in upstate New York, southern tier of New York State where I live and reside, getting my day started here this morning. And I'll be talking about my thoughts and take on blab. Yeah, I was blabbing yesterday. Blab, 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 blab. Good morning. Hey, we got Bill Weaver in the house. Good morning, Bill. We got Bernie Goldbach. Oh, wow. I got a star-studded room this morning. Good morning, folks. Good morning. And I'm just here at the computer desk getting the day started. And I want to welcome you here to my Periscope. How we doing? I gotta get some light in here. Hang on for a minute. There we go. I said it's better. Good morning. Good morning. Yeah. Yeah, I got the intro. I'm getting into this intro thing as far as every morning. And uh, I'm really digging it. And actually, that's uh, music that's from... It's actually the music over there in the YouTube audio library that I'm utilizing because it's free. So in case I want to uh, go ahead and uh, uh, archive this over on YouTube, I can go ahead and... uh, Use that particular music because it won't be, it won't copyright do any copyright infringements. Good morning, Bill Weaver. We have Bill Weaver, and I did see Bernie. So Bernie has a, a an internet connection this morning. I just I was listening to uh, Bernie Goldbach at Top Gold on all those fine social networks. Uh, uh, watching. Thank you, Bernie. I just got the tweet there. <laughs> thank you. Sir. Um, you got the tweet. Uh, on the periscope here and bill weaver um he's a good friend of mine bernie this is bill bill this is bernie we got two you are the two sole uh uh people in the audience and we have four web viewers because we have a total of six viewers so just to give a count there and i guess the web viewers i want to say good morning as well and um yeah i i was on the blab yesterday and it was pretty interesting as far as uh, um, I was going to do a Periscope, and somehow I got sidetracked doing uh, Blab. And Blab is very simple. You just sign in using your Twitter uh, account. And uh, I found it fairly simple as far as get, getting onto it. But I had more trouble reacquainting myself with my webcam uh, as such because it was... Uh, I hadn't used it probably six months. I think it was a Google Hangouts that I did probably before Christmas or something like that. So um, uh, I had more trouble with that than I did signing into Blab. And Bill Weaver is joining us again. And I'm just wondering if they, I'm on the Wi-Fi here on the uh, on the Android LG Ultimate two phone, I guess four point, and uh, I'm hands free. I've got it on the uh, the Jellyfish uh, smartphone holder on the Go, uh, Joby uh, tripod there on the computer desk. It enables me to give you the uh, the screenshots there as far as uh, off of the computer desk. And uh, uh, Bill, it's only my screen frozen. Oh, okay, so you can hear still hear. I don't know if you back out, Bernie. Can you hear me? I haven't seen Bernie chime in here. I did see him uh, saying he was watching, so I know his his uh, Wi-Fi or his uh, internet connection. He did tweet uh, that he is watching, following following you now. Oh no, that's something else. It's uh, oh, let's see. I got my my Twitter feed over here on the iPad Mini and stuff. So let's see what what's Bernie got. I did see something where he said he was watching or something like that. Yeah. Okay, there it is. Watching Fireman Rich. And 
But Blab, let me get back to Blab. Blab, uh, it's a combination. My take is it's a combination of Ustream, Google Plus, and Periscope wrapped up into one. You get you got four boxes. The Brady Bunch. If anybody remembers the old show Brady Bunch, you got the Brady Bunch boxes. You know when you have four people, you start with one, then you get two, and then you know there's. I think it's up to four, which I think is pretty good because in Google Hangouts, if you have more than four people, it gets a little crowded and a little loud. I thought it was fun. Um, I still like Periscope over Blab because I, I think it's a, a. I don't know. I just feel more comfortable uh, if I have a. I mean, I guess I look at Blab as what I wanted to do with Google Hangouts as far as a global conference, I called it, as far as I, I would be on Google Hangouts and have global conference, and anybody that would want to join could join. And that's what Blab is, basically. It's uh, it's live stream, nothing new about live stream. And, uh, uh, but I thought it was fun. I was engaged in, into it. I was drawn into it. It, uh, I could see some major uses for it. Uh, the thing is, uh, the, the Blab sessions that I watched yesterday, there was a few individuals in um, the so-called social media slash tech. They, they're toting it uh, is, uh, better than Google Hangouts. I don't know. There was at times it was laggy on the, uh, the, the chat. And it depends on that individual's connection, I believe. It's all dependent on that. I think that, that was the same with Ustream. If you have too many users, it's going to sap your bandwidth. Um, I could be wrong on that, but that's just my take that sometimes there's – it's all web-based. It's it's within the web uh, or web browser, and uh, I found that pretty interesting. I did do one on the Android LG Ultimate smartphone here. Um, it was via the the, the web browser, uh, Chrome, and I think there's a couple people that had issues with Chrome. And uh, let's see, who do I still have? Okay, I lost Bernie. He's probably watching on the web, and uh, or else he might be one of the web. Yeah, he's probably one of the web viewers because I've got uh, one viewer. I'm not even going to attempt to try and say that name. But uh, the one uh, scope viewer is in, so I've got three web viewers. So I'm just wondering if my uh, uh, connection is good enough to where uh, people are able to join. It did tweet out. But anyway, my take on uh, Blab is that I like it. I, I'll, I'll probably be using it, not as, a, as extensively as Periscope here. And uh, it was fun. Uh, I have used it here at the desk on my desktop as well as the Android phone here. So it's something new, um, but it's it's something new that's using a tech, you know, live stream is not new. Is what I'm saying. I guess it's new in a sense that it's a it's a new tool to be used by the masses here on social media. Uh, but I'm I'm one that okay, let's don't make more out of it than. What it actually is, um, I think it's pretty unique. Uh, I appreciate the, the 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 developers and the backers. I guess there's one uh, lab session I was on. It was one of the co-founders, and he's a VP. Can't think of his name. Along with the uh, the other gentleman that, um, oh yes, I do know their names because I have their thing up here. Uh, let's see, Sh uh, Sean Curry. He's the um, a vice president and head coach of Team Blab, as well as Michael Birch. Michael Birch, an interesting individual. He was being interviewed by uh, uh, Sean or Sheen. And um, so uh, uh, I think Michael Birch, they're basically where the money is coming from, keeping the Blab application going. I, I did ask if it was iOS on the iTunes store, and the, the impression I got was it was. I checked it wasn't, and, and actually it was uh, a link to where you could download the beta iOS, so it's not up in the iOS store. So uh, uh, that'll be interesting to see how that uh, rolls out. 
um, the blab. Yeah, this is my blab page. That's going to come in reverse because uh, my graphic at the beginning. But um, yeah, this gentleman, as well as this gentleman, were in the blab yesterday. Right now, I have uh, 23 followers and there's 27 followers in my blab session so uh i'm getting a getting a little bit of a following you know nothing nothing spectacular but uh uh some individuals that i do know that are uh, uh on the blab platform uh, like i said i'd like it's pretty interesting it's very busy as far as when you're in a session and you have the four boxes going along with the comments and then over on this side you can do your tweeting it keeps tab your tweeting so it's very engaging and interactive as far as uh, uh being web-based and uh, uh i enjoyed it i was uh, uh there was a couple sessions there i was sucked in i lost I, I i actually lost track of time so that that's that's an indication to me that hey this this is there's something going on here this is a pretty good uh uh thing so blab dot i am is where you go to and you can sign in with your Twitter handle uh, which I thought was pretty neat and uh, I'm on blab.im backslash or forward slash I don't know slash I'll just say slash because uh, I was watching one where coder says everybody says backslash it's not really a backslash it's a forward slash if you look at it and uh, good morning Nolan Mack I'm just talking a little bit and Bill Weaver's back in. Good morning. Okay, Bill Weaver's back. And we have Nolan Mack just talking a little bit about Blab here on Periscope. And I've seen a lot of people uh, using uh, Periscope with Blab uh, in conjunction as far as what they want to present. Uh, there's an uh, individual there. Uh, uh, who is it? Brian uh, Fanzo at iSocialFans. Uh, his take is, I talk fast, tweet faster. He's a change evangelist, a digital life streamer, strategist, and he's a good individual. He does a lot of this multi. I did see uh, my very first Blab live view was uh, one that Joel Kahn had done a couple nights ago where he was quadcasting. He was, I know, he was, he was, he was digging up all this old technology cameras to take a picture, and he had a GoPro that didn't have a battery or it was pretty fun and entertaining, and uh, um, I do like uh, Joel Com there. As far as uh, he's, he's, I'm a fan of, I'm a Joel Com fan. I, I guess I could say I like reading. I'm, I'm planning on getting his uh, latest book here. I'm sort of lallygagging on that. But interesting stuff yesterday with the blab and uh, something new that's out there. Something to watch. Um, I think it's uh, something that uh, people can be engaged with. I think. Uh, just like with Periscope, it can be incorporated in the things that you do probably in your daily life. I can see a lot of uh, we got basic blog tips joining us also. And it's, I guess I'm looking here, it's Leanna Smith. And Bill Weaver's still in the, I got it. I think Bill, did, I think Bill, you did a, a, a if I recall, I got to catch up on my scopes because I was watching the end of Deadliest Catch uh, last night. And last night was a season pre uh, season ending show, two hour special. So I, I sort of put the tweeting and all that up upside to focus in on that last night. But I did uh, um, see that you do have a, a periscope. I'm, I'm gonna have to catch up on that one. Um, I would have joined if I didn't uh, if I wasn't watching Deadliest Catch. So. I'm sorry, Bill. You took second fiddle or two, second fiddle to uh, deadliest catch. But I'm getting my day started here with the morning coffee. You can see it's uh, it's getting sunny out. Um, got uh, got Jack up here. Hey, Jack. Hello. There's Jack. <laughs> He's in the window. And uh, um, but I'm getting my day started here. As far as uh, um, after two days, being off two days, and uh, get back into the day job. And I'm taking it because Bill is not 
this probably this that, that's the thing about the the, the stuff that we uh, uh, have on the Periscope or on the uh, the uh, social media feeds here that uh, um, uh, what is it uh, the conductivity and stuff like that. I'm right underneath my router and I'm getting the impression now because I'm not seeing any comments that uh, you guys are able to hear me, you're able to see me, but you're not able to uh, comment in the uh, uh, Periscope here. So one of the many personalities of the stuff we use on social media. So, uh, um, But with that, I'm going to go ahead and uh, bug out of here. Uh, I want to say thank you for uh, uh, joining you all have a good one today and uh, live life, have fun, ciao for now, and as always, peace.